Hello people. Welcome to examsavvy.com. Exam Savvy is a site that has all the information related to examinations, scholarships, fellowships, educational loans and so on. So if you are an academic or an intellectual, maybe you will have to visit the site often. This video is about to explain to you everything about Indian Oil Scholarships. So what exactly is Indian Oil Scholarship? Indian, Indian Oil Corporation Limited, headquartered in New Delhi, is one of the biggest Indian enterprises and has found its success ladder to the highest ranked companies in the Fortune Global 500 listings this year, turning a profit of around rupees 7,000 crores. They are offering around 2,600 merit scholarships under IOCL Educational Scholarships for the Indian students of secondary and higher secondary level. So what exactly is Indian Oil Scholarship? Indian Oil Scholarship Limited, headquartered in New Delhi, is one of the largest Indian enterprises enterprises and has found its success later to the highest ranked companies in the Fortune Global 500 listings this year. Turning a profit of around rupees 7,000 crores, they are offering around 2,600 Nere scholarships under IOCL educational scholarships for the Indian students of secondary and higher secondary level. 10 plus ITI, MBBS, Engineering, MBA on a merit basis. So let me run you through the uh, scholarship one more time. Indian Oil Corporation Limited headquartered in New Delhi is one of the largest Indian enterprises and has found its success letter to the highest ranked companies in the Fortune Global 500 listings this year. Turning a profit of, of around 7,000 crores, they are offering around 2,600 merit scholarships under IOCL educational scholarships for the Indian students of secondary and higher secondary level. 10 plus ITI, MBBS, Engineering, MBA on a merit basis. Indian Oil Merit Scholarships for 10th ITA students of 2,600 scholarships, Indian Oil Scholar uh, Corporation Limited has chosen about 2,000 scholarships to the students who are passing out their 10th and ITA candidates. The scholarship amount is rupees 1,000 per month for duration of two years. The eligibility of the scholarship is to secure 60 percentile for girls, SCs, and STs. The same scholarship can be availed by general category students by securing 65 percentage and for the PWDs persons with disabilities it is 50 percentage has the eligibility. The minimum eligibility marks score remains to be the same for all over IOCL scholarships too. I Indian Oil Merit Scholarship for 10th ITA students. Of 2,600 scholarships, Indian Oil Scholarship Limited has chosen about 2,000 scholarships to the students who are passing out their 10th and ITA candidates. The scholarship amount is rupees 1,000 per month for a duration of two years. The eligibility for the scholarship is to secure 60 percentile forms for girls, SEs, and STs. The same scholarship can be availed by general category students by securing 65 percentage and and for the PWs, PWDs, persons with disabilities, it is 50 percentage as the eligibility. The minimum eligibility marks course remain to be the same for all IOCL scholarships too. Scholarship for Engineering of the remaining 600 scholarships, 300 scholarships are arranged for the students aspiring for engineering studies. The duration for this engineering professional course study spans for four, four years. The scholarship fee amounts to rupees 3,000 per month. Scholarship for Engineering Of the remaining six, uh, 600 scholarships, 300 scholarships are arranged for the students aspiring for engineering studies. The duration for this engineering professional course study spans for four years. The scholarship fee amounts to rupees 3,000 per month. Scholarship for Medical of the remain sc remaining scholarships, 200 scholarships are awarded to students who are aspiring for medical studies or MBBS. It also spans for the duration of four years and the amount is rupees 3000 per month. Scholarship for medical. Of the remaining scholarships, 200 scholarships are awarded to students who are aspiring for medical studies or MBBS. It also spans for the duration of four years and the amount is rupees 3000 3, 3, per month. Scholarship for MBA. The remaining 100 scholarships are for the graduated students who are aspiring to 
pursue MBA. The scholarship amount is rupees three thousand and is for the for a span of two years. The scholarships are provided equally zone wise, north, south, east, west, with keeping in mind the number of students appearing for the twelfth standard examinations for the respective year. Scholarship for MBA. The remaining hundred scholarships are for the graduated students who are aspiring to pursue MBA. The scholarship amount is rupees three thousand and is for a span of two years. The scholarships are provided equally zone wise, north, south, east, west, with keeping in mind the number of students appearing for the twelfth standard examinations for the respective year. Let's take a look at the application process now. The scholarship needs to be applied only online. Once awarded, the scholarship fee is sent via demand draft to the head principal of the institution from whom the scholar needs to collect the amount. Also, students have to be enrolled to only one single scholarship during their tenure of education. Let me run you through the application one more time. The scholarships needed to be applied only online. Once awarded, the scholarship fee is sent via demand draft to the head principal of the institution from whom the scholar needs to be needs to collect the amount. Also, students have to be enrolled to only one single scholarship during their tenure of education. Let's take a look at the gross income of the family. The gross income of the family from all sources during the respective financial year should not exceed rupees one lakh per month. The total income of the family should not exceed sixty thousand rupees in case of a tie occurring between two students. Preference would be given to the student whose family's income does not exceed sixty thousand rupees. Gross income of the family. The gross income of the family from all sources during the respective financial year should not exceed rupees one lakh per annum. The total income of the family should not exceed sixty thousand rupees in case of a tie occurring between students. Preference would be given to the student whose family's income does not exceed sixty thousand rupees. Let's take a look at the documents to be submitted. List of the documents to be submitted: tenth mark sheet, twelfth mark sheet, income certificate issued by authority of the civic body, date of certi birth certificate, OBC certificate, SC or SC ST caste certificate, PWD certificate, copy of bank passbook showing the name of the account holder, account number, bank name, bank branch, bank address. List of the documents to be submitted. 10th mark sheet 12th mark sheet income certificate issued by the authority of civic body uh, date of birth certificate obc certificate sc st caste certificate pwd certificate copy of bank passbook showing the name of the account holder account number bank name bank branch bank address i believe you have learned a lot about the indian oil scholarships thank you for watching more information at examsavvy.com have a great day ahead.